Hi, I'm Kelly with Blue Water Photo, and as you can see in front of me, we have all the pieces for the Dyron Quick Release Kit for the Rexy S100, S95, and S90 housings. Today I'm going to quickly show you how all these pieces go together so you can easily assemble your new kit. First, we have all the pieces. Here is the Dyron kit. There are three pieces. First, you have the locking pin with that silver pin. Second, there is the quick release ring that attaches to the camera housing. And third, there is the ring that will attach to your wide angle lens. If you are also planning to do macro photography and you bought the Dyron macro lens, you will have also purchased the 67 millimeter quick release ring that works with that lens. Now let me show you how it all gets put together. The first step you need to do is take your housing. The Rexy housings have a protective cap over the threads. Simply unscrew this cap to reveal the 52 millimeter threads. The first thing you attach is the locking pin. Make sure that silver pin is pointed away from the housing and simply slide that over the front of the port. The second step is the quick release ring. That goes right on top of that locking pin and screws on to the threads on the front of your camera. Now you want to make sure we tighten down the locking pin. You can see it moves up and down. You want that to be all the way up flush against that quick release ring. So hold that in place with the pin at the top of the port and use the included Allen wrench to tighten it down. Once it is good and tight, does not move, double check that it is flush against that quick release ring. Let's move on to the lenses. To attach the quick release rings to the wide angle lens, simply take the piece and screw it with that lever, excuse me, with that ridge pointed out so that it can slide over the quick release piece. Do the same for the macro lens. Simply screw it into place. so that it is set to go. You're now ready to use your quick release kit. To do this, all you need to do is slide the piece on, rotate it so that it clicks over that pin, and then your lens is good to go and will not rotate or fall. If your shade on the wide angle lens is not lined up perfectly so that the large wing is on the top and the bottom, simply loosen the four Allen screws that are on the edge of the lens and rotate your shade until it is perfectly up and down and then you will be good to go and you will not get any of the shade in your photos. If you have any questions on setting up your quick release kit for the Dyron lenses with the Rexy housing, please feel free to contact us. You can find all of our information online at www.bluewaterphotostore.com. Thank you.